I love life. And I think there are so many things to be experienced in it that I feel like the longer, the better. Uh, I can't say what I'll be doing in 10 years from now. All I know is that being physically and mentally fit will contribute to my freedom as I age. So I, I really cherish that. And for a long time, while I was a, a very dedicated student, I said, oh, well, I will not turn this into a job like I've done with all my other passions in life. It just happened by itself. And I think sometimes the danger with that is that because you turn a passion into a professional activity, you might deviate from your own practice. So what I've learned with time, and I always tell my guests and my students is, if you have two hours for your practice, do two hours. But if you have only 15 minutes, at least do something with these 15 minutes. So waking up for me involves a routine with hot water and lemon, then obviously emptying the bowels because we need to be comfortable to work on breathing. And then if I don't have more than that available, the first 15 minutes of my morning will be dedicated to specific stretching exercises that are designed to open up the rib cage creates space in the lungs and then 15 to 20 minutes at least will be dedicated solely to breath work and needless to say to me it's a very very important part of it there is no way the phone should be turned on before doing that because that is one of the major causes of agitation and if you start the day with a mental agitation is likely that you spend the day with mental agitation. Whereas if you dedicate these few moments to yourself and to your calm and to your peace of mind in the morning, when you turn on to the real world, everything's going to be like, it's much easier, it's much smoother, and I'm not affected by stress as much as I'm usually. Um, so right away you get benefits that you can experience throughout the day and then in terms of long life as well. And does that phone rule apply to later in the day as well, especially just before you go to bed? Totally, totally. Um, actually, I, I very often joke about it um, in this environment, in other environments, when I ask people to leave the phone out, sometimes it seems to be very disturbing. And so I just demonstrate, you know, this, this little thing that, look, you know, when you, when you pull down on the screen, you can push that little plane button and you activate the airplane mode of your phone. You're not switching it off, you're just disconnecting. And I say that what we do with breath work is a way to activate the airplane mode of the brain. And so definitely the phone is not a friend that should be taken to bed, definitely not. And what is your, uh, you say you don't know what you're going to be doing in 10 years time. Do you have longevity aspirations? Do you think about the decades ahead and perhaps what you might like to do? Um, yeah, it's um, going slightly maybe out of the scope of this conversation, but I am, I'm totally convinced, I think it's been a quest in my life, that the body and the mind are an ecosystem and we have to interact with the world, which is an ecosystem. So I think the more I age or the more I go forward in life, the more I feel concerned with how can I help the world live longer so that I can also have a higher life quality for all the years to come because I expect to be around for decades and I'd like that to happen in a world where I can breathe fresh air, where I can see the fish and the coral in the ocean where I can still find snow on the mountains that I like to climb. And so this is probably the, the way I'm moving forward now is always increasing the awareness of the deep interaction between the ecosystem that we are and the natural world that we have to live in. This episode is brought to you in association with Clinique La Prairie, the award-winning spa clinic and pioneering health and wellness destination nestled on the shores of Lake Geneva in Montreux, Switzerland.
Combining preventative medicine with bespoke lifestyle and nutrition plans, Clinique La Prairie offers a holistic approach to living fuller, healthier, and longer lives.